Hey baseball fans, how's it going? Hayden here. And in today's video, I will be going over what I think the next steps are for the New York Mets. So let's get right into it. So the New York Mets starting pitching rotation is and still has been dragging on these last couple months. They did, however, solve some answers by trading for Carrasco and Lindor on Thursday. But having Syndergaard come back from Tommy John anytime in May, June, or July, or whenever, is a big question mark. And it is questionable how reliable and useful he could be. So the Mets need one more starting pitcher to keep that rotation nice and strong. That is why I think pitching is the next thing we should focus on. I think one pitcher who fits this description is free agent pitcher Tejon Walker. Tejon Walker is coming off a decent 2020 season with four wins, three losses, a 2.70 ERA, and a whip of 1.163, as well as 50 strikeouts. Walker's strength has to get right-handed hitters out in 2020. Walker kept right-handed batters at 178, 252, 263 slash line. A big success factor was Walker's use for his cutter was improving. His effective cutter made him rank 13th in whiff percent, amazing all pitchers. The only question for Taewon Walker's role with the Mets is how he handled against lefties, which he has had his fair share of trouble with them, but I think it is something he can work on. I think these next couple weeks are very urgent. The Mets need to have a strong rotation to back up their offensive runs. Currently, the Mets' starting rotation would look like DeGrom, Stroman, Carrasco, Peterson, and probably Matz because the Mets have stated Lugo will stay in the bullpen. The problem with this is Steven Matz. After looking at Matz, the Mets have gave him plenty of chances and time's up. I think it is very unlikely he will return to his 2015 self. There is no more stalling, no more waiting. The Mets are in a win-now mode. The, at this rate, Steven Matz, if he stays, which he most likely will, he is better in the bullpen. The Mets should just consider starting pitchers for the rest of this offseason. The bats and offense are great now. It just comes to the pitching backing them up. If the Mets want to play baseball in October against a team like the Dodgers, Cardinals, or Braves, they would want a scary three-starter rotation to show off and scare the hitters. Pitching wins championships, I personally believe, and so many other Met fans have said. The Mets are off to a great offseason. They address their need at starting catcher, obtaining a star player, and an above-average starter. Now, it is time to play the waiting game. But please, feel free to let me know in the comments. Do you agree with the Mets signing Taewon Walker? Do you agree with the Mets only signing pitchers? Till next time, baseball fans. See ya.